Well, hi, I'm John Hart, and welcome back to Mr. America Hart. All right, so the most dangerous position that I find that people are doing when they're squatting. Boy, we're going to get to that one right now. Traditionally speaking, when we've been taught to squat, traditionally, a lot of powerlifters, bodybuilders have been taught to stare at the point up where the ceiling meets the wall. So they start off with the bar on their back, and they're staring up like this, you know, bar back there, and they're staring up like this. And when they hit the bottom of the squat motion, they have to actually look even higher to keep their face and their eyes pointing at that spot at the ceiling and the wall juncture. Now, that to me does not seem super, super safe because you are going to be hyperextending your neck. By the time you hit that bottom position of the squat, and we see it all the time, the neck cranked all the way up like that is not good for the back of the neck. Any hyperextension, overextension of any joint in general is just bad. That, bad for the neck. So we, we don't like that. Okay, so there it is. That one out the door. Secondly, neutral position. What is neutral position? Neutral is I'm standing right now and looking directly straight ahead at the wall or if I'm squatting in front of a mirror, I'm facing a mirror, I'm looking at myself in the eyes and I have a space between my jaw and my clavicle about fist size. That distance will remain the same from here to here as I'm at the top position and when I hit the bottom position. What am I doing as I squat down? I'm actually looking through my eyebrows as I'm squatting. So I know I've hit the right head position when I've hit the bottom of my squat when I'm looking through my eyebrows at myself. So as my back goes a little bit as I squat down, so does my face. It goes a little bit as I squat down. That right there to me seems appropriate. Neutral neck position, neutral spine position at the top as well as at the bottom of the squat and all the way through. That seems fairly safe. Now, the most alarming one of all that I'm getting to, that I've seen, a trend even. Man, in recent years, certain uh, lifters, they like to look at, look at this, the opposite spot from the ceiling and the wall. They want to look at the wall where it meets the floor. So their chin is down like this when they have the bar on their back and when they hit the bottom of the squat. And it's actually beyond neutral. It's actually lower than neutral. So uh, this one, I suppose for an experienced lifter who has practiced it and has done it very, very often, uh, again, practicing it, that would not be so bad, okay? But looking slightly down, the lower back uh, may tend to round, or the upper back may tend to round, one or the other or both. And I'm not saying you're going to bury it. I'm not going to say saying that you're going to hit the floor uh, where your eyes go, your back goes, and all that stuff. But it opens up the possibility. Anything other than neutral, to me, in my mind, opens up the possibility that you're going to head that way. Hyperextended, you're going to keep an arch over arch like that. Neutral will be just right, but then rounded with your neck rounding down will lend itself to opening up of the back, in the upper back at least. And I hate to see anybody relax and round. Why is this alarming? Well, it's gotten perverted. I've seen it in the public gyms. I've been around the gyms. And I see people squatting and they're looking down, literally down at the floor. They're not even looking six or 10 feet in front of them at a point where the wall meets the floor. They're looking down at the floor when they're squatting. That in and of itself, wow, just dangerous, really dangerous. I don't care what anybody says, just plain dangerous. You don't squat and look down at the floor. Okay, that's the big takeaway message right here. Um, opening up the neck that much, you are going to round. It's just, it's going to happen. Get a little bit tired, you're going to round. So that's my belief, and uh, that's it. <laughs> Probably a good technique for some lifters, but not necessarily for all. And we've seen how this can actually get perverted. And there are people out there squatting on the regular in the gyms, and they are literally looking down at the floor when they're squatting. And I, I just don't roll with that, and I don't recommend it for anybody that I train. So that's it for today. From my heart to you, John Hart. Listen, before you go, 
Off to my left, you're gonna see a subscribe button pop up right about now. Will you give that thing a tap and let YouTube know that you like my videos? And then down below, off to your left, you're gonna see a thumbs up button. That is the thumbs up. I really love these videos John's doing and Mr. America Heart. And the YouTube algorithm really loves that as well. So won't you hit that one and turn it blue. I appreciate it. See you soon.